Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that. We have got catkins elongated. I dare say we are shedding pollen. Oh, look at that. Here we go. It's official. That's a female flower right there. I'm not sure if it's going to show up or not. I'll take a picture. That is a female flower, female blossom. It is official here at Nut Haven. We have elongated and uh, catkins shedding pollen. And we do have some female flowers that have emerged. I'm gonna run over to Hazel Acres and start checking some shrubs there and uh, see if we've got any female blossoms. But oh boy, oh boy, spring is underway. Here at Nut Haven, we found our first female flower just poking out on March 21st. At Hazel Acres, it was the next day on the 22nd. It has begun, pollination is underway. I don't imagine things to really ramp up for another week. Heck, we might even get some snow in the next couple of days. Well, we're out here in the orchard. Uh, we have pollination occurring. Unfortunately, we were getting some real heavy rains here and some snow is even possible tonight. So uh, hopefully that won't put too much of a damper. Uh, we still have plenty of male catkins that haven't started to elongate yet. Plenty of female flowers that uh, are female buds that haven't flowered yet. So we've still got plenty of time here. Well, lovely. A little bit of snow. We find our first uh, female flowers just trying to pop out. And then we get a little bit of snow. Ooh. Bah humbug. The snow is gone. Things have warmed up. And now we're back to a typical spring day in Iowa. Windy, 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 which is good. After all, hazelnuts are wind pollinated. Well, there they are, the female flowers in full effect. And we've got male catkins that are starting to shed and elongate. Oh, happy day. And there's plenty of wind to blow the pollen around. So this is exciting. Well, it's been a week since we saw our first female flowers starting to peek out from the bud. And now it seems we have flowers all over the place. Holy moly, look at all of the female blossoms on this one. Boy, here's a whole mess of female blossoms. So looking forward to having a lot of nut clusters on this one. And look at all the catkins on this one. Holy moly. Shedding that pollen. It really is amazing how we have some shrubs that uh, have flowers here and uh, they've got some male catkins starting to elongate and uh, shed that pollen. Yet we have other plants that uh, honestly, it doesn't seem like they've done much of anything at all. This one here still has very tightly packed Catkins hasn't started to elongate at all. Absolutely no indication of any flowering. So just a lot of diversity out here in the hazelnuts, uh, which is a good thing. So we have uh, plenty of shrubs that are providing that pollen early, and then hopefully we'll continue to provide that pollen source as some of these uh, other shrubs start to have those female blossoms emerge. And that's a nice sight, all of those male catkins Shedding that pollen. Do your dance. And likewise, all of these absolutely beautiful blossoms. And that's the view from Nut Haven. The old March saying is in like a lion, out like a lamb. Well, it's the last day of March and you can see from the snow behind me, somebody got it wrong this year. So we have pollination occurring out in the hazelnut orchard. Uh, we're taking a look at some of the female flowers and the male catkins 
The good news is, is that even though it's cold and we've got a little snow here, uh, pollination is still occurring and uh, there are still some female flowers that haven't even emerged yet and some male catkins that aren't shedding their pollen as well so we've still got a ways to go here for full pollination uh, we're going to keep taking a look here in the orchard and seeing what we can find and pruning is just around the corner so stay tuned in april we're going to be getting the loppers out and having a lot of fun pruning up our hazelnut shrubs